a country in West Africa. The population here is 15 million. However, it has experienced many challenges. I'm going to pray. Allah Akbar. How is business? Come on, business function actuellement. Bon, alhamdulillah, mais on a beaucoup de difficultés là. Mais comme je vais à la prière là, donc je n'ai pas le temps pour répondre à toutes ces questions. Uh, we can say thank God. We still have some difficulties, but since I'm going to the prayer, I don't have much time to talk. It's a fruit. Its name is cola. It's used very, very much in Guinea, especially in any social interaction. Anything related to respect, you are going to people, socially with respect, you have to buy this and you give them. If you want to marry a woman, you have to buy 30 of this. You give them 10 by 10. The first greeting, you send 10. You greet the family with this one. The second greeting, you go with 10. You greet them with this one. The third greeting, to get the hand of the woman, you go with 10 of this. It's, real, it's very used in our culture in terms of respect. It's very uh, meaningless in terms of money, but in terms of respect, it's highly respected. So right now from the food market, we are now in the tailor parts. They are all tailors. They are uh, trying to sti stitch um, uh, tissues together. When you buy, for example, female, most often female use these tailors, to make their uh, suits. So you buy tissue, you come to them, you see them, and they stitch them together. So they are called tailors, we are in the tailor's part. It is in this country where the late South African musician, Miriam Makeba lived while in exile. West Africa has recently been rocked by military uprisings. In the past three years, the presidents of Mali, Burkina Faso, and Guinea were removed from power. Currently under the transitional government, the economic community of West Africa, states, ECOWAS, a regional body, gave Guinea 24 months to hold elections after the coup in 2021. The African Union suspended the country. Sophie Mokwena, SABC News, Guinea.